I'm entering a new chapter and it feels so good. I feel very empowered and to be mm -hmm. honest, I feel like it came at the right time and it feels good. It feels right. And when you have that in your heart, parang ang sarap ng pakiramdam. So that's what I feel. Well, it's obvious on your face, Leia. Now, you. Uh, can you share with us how your journey to the Kapuso Network began and, and how it went? Well, um, to be honest, it took us a lot of months, right? Mm -hmm. Siyempre, hindi naman lingit sa kaalaman ninyo that um, this past year has been challenging, not only for us, but for all of us. And it gave me a time to think and reflect on the things about my life, what I really want to do, mm -hmm. How do I want to move on? And um, what else do I want to do? do I, what else do I want to chase when it comes to my dreams? Mm -hmm. And so, um, nung, nung dumating yung offer sa akin, parang ano, parang, you know, parang it, it, I, I consider it as a big blessing. And so, the negotiations began and Yun nga, kagaya na sinabi ko sa inyo kanina, parang hindi siya mabigat na type of negotiation. Mm -hmm. It was as if there was a respect for each other's boundaries. And so parang for me, it totally just came naturally. It, it, it totally just flowed naturally. And here I am. <laughs> I am officially a kapuso. Yes, you are. But, but of course, uh, there are no easy decisions, whether in life or in our professional career. Pero... Uh, would you like to share also how your decision was made? How it was made? Yes. What Except were the things the that you considered? Of, with the help of my manager. And plus, to be honest, I am ready to chase more dreams, not only mm -hmm. with acting. And this time, I feel like I want to discover more about myself. Say, uh, I would like to explore the idea of probably having a talk show. Wow! <laughs> that is something exciting. Having a talk show or like appearing on, um, say, sitcoms. Mm -hmm. Kanina lang, kausap po si John Lloyd. Sabi niya, i-guest na daw ako sa sitcom niya. Wow! <laughs> so, there, parang ano, parang, um, I, I think I am ready to mm -hmm. be more open to doing so many different things. Mm -hmm. I feel like yun yung natutunan ko rin dito sa pandemic to, you know, take on new possibilities and challenges. Right. Of course, Bea, there are things that, uh, there are also questions that need to be asked. Now, since you came from uh, ABS, did you say goodbye to the Kapamilya executives and how did it go? Definitely. In fact, um, when the deal was 99% final, mm -hmm. um, it was the first time that I met them via Zoom, my new bosses. Uh, the next day, I um, I called my um, boss before in ABS, who was Sir Carlo, right. and um, I asked for his blessing. And, um, syempre, it was a very emotional call. No, it was a very emotional phone call. Di mo may alis that. 20 years of my life I spent there, I mean, being with them. And so, you know what? He wished me well and that he wished me good luck. Kasi ganun naman talaga hindi ba? Life must go on. Mm -hmm. And um, I'm happy that I had this blessing before being here. And so, all is well. That is nice to know. Again, Bea, congratulations uh, to this uh, new endeavors of yours and your journey as a Kapuso. We look forward to, uh, to your projects in GMA. Thank, Thank you, you, me too. too. Oh. Gusto ko nang i-announce hindi pa yata po pwede. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, thank you, Bea, and welcome to GMA again. Thank, thank you, thank you. Thank you. thank you so much, Nikki. And congratulations. Um, Bea, 20 years um, sa showbiz industry and ngayon, new beginnings bilang kapuso. What are you most grateful for? I am grateful for the trust that they have given me. I am grateful for this huge blessing. Imagine at this point in my life, I am beginning to rediscover myself again. I am going to make new friends. I am going to meet new people and collaborate with new people. That's such a huge blessing for someone like me who loves to do what I'm doing. 
and this time I will be introduced to a totally new audience and I just hope that magustuhan din nila yung gagawin ko and actually bago yung challenge yan sa akin because di ba parang ang purpose ko kasi is to really in my deepest of hearts it's really to touch lives and to do characters that will resonate with a lot of Filipinos dito man o sa ibang parte ng mundo and I know that I will be able to do that with she and me Thank you, Bea. Ang ngayong pandemic, naging active ka sa YouTube channel mo. Uh, lagi ka namin pinapanood. Um, is, the, is this something na... Um, Siyempre, bukod, bukod kay Ayan, ay, ay, Siyempre, gusto ko makatrabaho si Aldan sa television naman para mas mahaba, kasi masayang sa akin sa akin si Aldan. Bukod doon, nakatrabaho ko na si Ding Dong, sabi ko lang, pero ang pa rin ko parang nakatrabaho sa isang dalang serye. But bukod din kay Ding Dong, siyempre gusto ko makatrabaho din si Marian. Parang parang interesting din ang pagsama-sama kami dalawa. And also, dahil ang first love team ko talaga, Bago si John Lloyd ay si Dennis Trillo. So gusto ko ulit siyang makatrabaho. So ano pa yan, many many years ago, bagets pa kaming dalawa. So ayun, I look forward to working with him. And of course, I also look forward to um, working with Derek, who was my uh, leading man in many of my movies. And um, also, yung other girls then, like si Janelin Mercado, also si Celeste, si Na Lovey. Um, Sina Sanya, who gave her message to Nina, also Barbie. Shabi yung younger ones like Sina Jasmine, Sina Ruru. A lot of I can name a lot of names, but you know, basically all of them. <laughs> uh, and lastly, na lang, how? Ani yung hinuhok mo na magiging reaction ng mga supporters mo and mga fans mo dito sa new move mo sa career. Siyempre, I, siyempre, I'm hoping that they embrace my decision and that they are happy as um, as I am happy with what I have decided to do with my career. And um, I hope that they continue to um, support me and um, I hope that they continue to grow with me. Okay. Thank you, Bea, and uh, congratulations. Thank you. Thank you, Alan. Kanya kanina same setup na eh. <laughs> um, sa totoo lang, hindi ko nakausap kasi si John Lloyd um, during the process of dealing with my bosses now because I truly honor the confidentiality of the deal yes. and I trusted na sila din, they would do the same for me. At yun na nga ang nangyari. So, hindi ko, hindi ko nasabihan. Nagpaalam lang ako nung nung magpapaalam ako kay Sir Carlo that was the only time I asked them I asked for their blessing kung okay lang ba, di ba? But um, yung kay John Lloyd, hindi ko na-disclose sa kanya, parang pali naman kasi because it's very confidential it's a deal between me and GMA but ngayon, pwedeng-pwede na <laughs> kanina lang parang ilang ilang minuto lamang ay nakausap ko si John Lloyd and he's very happy for me and I know even without talking to him, I know that uh, he cares about me and I care about him deeply. So, alam ko masaya kami sa bawat yugto ng buhay ng isa't isa. Kahit na hindi kami magkasama. At lalong-lalo na pag magkasama. Yes. And Bea, last na, pwede mo bang batiin yung mga fans mo sa dito sa Japan ngayong kapuso ka na? Hello! Hello sa inyong lahat. Uh, maraming maraming sa support, salamat sa support mo ninyo sa akin through the years and um, sana makabalik po ako dyan sana madalaw ko kayo dyan when um, the world is safer at kapag nagbaba na yung ng, ng borders ang mga countries especially Japan and um, sana po hinihingi ko po ang support na nyo na panoorin ako this time sa GMA because I promise you we will be creating quality shows for you Thank you Bea and congratulations Thank you, Ms. Dal. Ayan, nakaka-excite naman. Pumunta ng Japan. Di ba? Parang everybody loves Japan talaga. <laughs> Sobra. Alam mo ba, itong last week, puro Japanese food yung pinakain ko. Araw-araw. Tapos sabi ko, parang mali na yata na puro rice. Ilaw na isda yung pinakain ko. <laughs> With Ding Dong, I've seen 
how professional he is. I've seen the way he acts and I know he takes his job very, very seriously. And I have seen Marianne act and she's, I think she's so beautiful. And um, na-touch din ako dun sa message na Barbie kasi excited na excited siya. And si na Sanya, kahit si na Gabby, si na Kanil, ang dami-dami pa, hindi ko na masasabi lahat. Pero I am very thankful because parang ang init-init ng pagtanggap nila at ramdam na ramdam ko yun. Wow, thank you. At sana makagawa ka rin na ibang uh, genre dyan sa... Uh, sana nga po. Sana this time. Pero ngayon kasi mas open na talaga ako. Parang hmm. ayoko nang bigyan masyadong ng limit ang sarili ko. We only live once. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. And congrats. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Hmm. Thank you, Tito Eugene. Ayan. YOLO nga daw. <laughs> Yun pala yung key takeaway. Key takeaway ko sa sagot niya, Miss Bea, YOLO. You only live once. You live once? Yes. Ayan. So, may tanong naman na sinend sa atin all the way from Bacolod. Ayan. This is from Erwin Nicavera from Sunstar Bacolod. So, this is his question. Sa so, pagfirma mo ng kontrata sa GMA, Ready ka na bang sumabak sa lock-in tapings? And what is your message to your fans na buong-buo pa rin ang support na sa'yo sa new chapter mo at sa kapuso? Um, Doon sa unang tanong, ready-ready na ako mag-lock-in tapings. At alam mo, ang napansin ko sa lahat ng mga naglo-lock-in tapings, lahat ng mga artista, mga direktor, parang iba yung, yung uh, level of closeness nila. And di ko pa na-experience eh, na mag-lock-in simula ng pandemic. So, I am very, very excited. At bukod doon, excited akong libutin ang bago kong tahanan. Excited akong lumibot sa shows ng, ng GMA at makilala ang mga taong makakatrabaho ko in the future. Sa so, totoo, yung mga nagtitext na science si na Iya, na sinasabi nila na dapat daw dumaan ako sa Mars pa more. <laughs> May mga nagtitext na. So I'm very, very excited. At para sa mga supporters ko, Kagabi sa totoo lang, most of them nakausap ko because we had um, an intimate fancy because I wanted them to hear it directly from me before it even comes out because that's how important they are to me. And narinig na nila to kagabi that hindi yata enough yung words to thank them how grateful I am. Nakasama ko sila throughout my entire 20-year journey. And this time that I am embarking on this new adventure. Sana makasama ko pa rin sila at sana makasama ko silang mag-grow at matutunan yung mga bagong bagay sa buhay ko. So yun lang. Uh, I think more than anything, it's just thank you. Napaka sweet naman nun. Talagang sobrang I'm sure na appreciate yun ng fans mo na you have to... Emotional din kami kagabi. <laughs> para ko nang... As in, hey, okay. buong week, ganun. Yung feeling ko, yung sobrang happy, napapatili ako. Tapos, syempre, meron din parang kaban. Ano. It's very, it's very, it's all very surreal para sa akin. Talagang, I'm sure, 